Whoa, there's a call? Nightclub? No, we're having our intimate moment right now. Somewhat intimate moment. I'm trying to find a <laughs> toilet. <laughs> hmm. There is a more romantic place, which is this place. I could play the piano for him, but I can't play the piano in real life. Anyway. I'm too comfortable to do this. What am I doing? No, I don't want to fertilize that. That decides about weddings. Uh -huh. Well, Clay is too tired now. So we better go home. Ooh, wedding fancy. In a good mood after picturing the perfect wedding. I don't know what a perfect wedding is. <laughs> so we better go home. We're back. Avarice Acres. Yeah, better uh, sell those things. Everybody's up. I guess so. They did sleep. Yes, they did. You do need to be. You need. To, you do need to eat eggs, Benedict. I prepared that for you. Ah, uh, I want to know how to make eggs, Benedict. I think I should always uh, make eggs, Benedict. <laughs> it's like everybody wants to go into the TV <laughs> because there's a TV right there. They can just. Um, he had scuba. Scuba. Mmm, eggs benedict. I think that's toast, egg, and... What do you call that sauce again? <laughs> now we just Bukata. talk about some things. It's <laughs> like, so at least we will be closer to each other. The best thing about being a parent is getting close to your kids. But that's also a challenge of its own. Talk about nacho cheese. Alright. The only nacho cheese I ever tasted was a flavor from a chip. I never... Wait, I did... I think I did, I actually, I did maybe eight actual nacho cheese. It was, it was, when I was quite uh, young, it was when we were going through, going to the capital and I want to, want to eat something and I chose that with the sauce and the chips, yeah. But that product really didn't last long. I think it was not popular enough. And why are we watching some children's show? I don't know, we do have a child, right? <laughs> Rather than sleep, you should eat first. <laughs> what the heck was that? Wait, did Clay just wants to woohoo move with himself? What? Oh, that is me. I want to woohoo with Clay. Mind if I do. <laughs> Why are you trying to hug your father outside the house? Also, uh... Hire a specific cater. Hire a specific cater, because apparently these four people, uh, yuck. no. Okay, he's just he's gonna eat the eggs benedict. And please eat it. Thank you. Then you need to sleep afterwards. Ooh, I'm about to work. I should, uh, record that too. But Sienna should go explore space. Because maybe she wants a taste of space. Taste of space, but... Alright, everything is in the inferno inside me. Alright. <laughs> Can he do it in his own mark? Yep. Ooh, a mysterious message. Once in orbit, Sienna gets an odd message from the International Sim Space Station. It gets badly garbled and it makes little sense. Sienna decides to fly over and check it out. Alright. I'm already having fun, better sleep. Okay. Sienna arrives at the station with an unusually, unusually dark. She flips on the flashlight and is startled by the disheveled looking astronaut. Thank goodness you came. Our main power coupling is shot. Is there anything you can do to help? Radio for help. You're not good at this. Sunset Valley, we have a problem. Sienna apologizes for not having the skills to fix the station and sends a message to the rocket headquarters a few days before help arrives. But the astronaut should make it, assuming no one hogs all the blind. <laughs> All right, what does what does that mean? And she has a live space squid. And she, wow, rocket science skill. And she returns safely. Nice. We should. It's join myself to work, and hopefully, I could actually do more work, and maybe diagnose uh, patients properly. Unlike the last time I did it. <laughs> Unlike the last time. And I'm off to work. Oh, she's having a fever. Compelling diagnosis? Sweaty shivers? Uh, no. I need to stop leisurely walking uh -huh. to the patient. 
should do it faster. Decent. Okay. I don't need to look at the hypno frog. No. The problem is I don't no. Let me scan the patient first. Hmm, compelling diagnosis. Is it the llama flow or the sweaty shivers? She is bur burning belly. What does these things mean? These icons. The difference is burning belly looks different. Let me check. Decent diagnosis chance. But I should be... Uh, analyze the sample. Let's analyze. <laughs> now let's check the patient's ears here. To Darius. Uh, check ears so we can have a nice performance for our work. And I should be focusing this, but... Yeah, the proper mood for here is for being focused. Apparently I'm gonna get a, a promotion? Maybe. I don't know because I need to successfully diagnose and treat five patients, which is... I only did one and it's off camera. I'm sorry, but I, I thought I was going to do this. <laughs> Of camp because yeah. So what is your compelling diagnosis? Oh no. Oh no, it's an outbreak. A viral disease is broken out nearby. The hospital needs a doctor to get it treated and vacant. Click to the front desk for an outbreak. I need to log that on first. And go to the outbreak. Yes, let's go. Oh my god, why did this happen? <laughs> Why is Katharina Caliente right here? Apparently there uh, suddenly she teleports here. Alright. God damn it, the realism is broken, man. Oh, nice shoes, Katharina. I mean Katrina. Oh, oh. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Why am I trying to learn this? But <laughs> Literally nothing is happening here. I'm gonna go to return to hospital. And we're back. Ooh, there's a new orderly. Compelling diagnosis of itchy, not itchy plum bob, no. Maybe it is llama flu. Uh, better treat the patient. Let's see if I'm good. Oh no. God damn it. Or do we have a ghost as a check ears? What the heck did I do? What the heck did I do? <gasps> what the heck did I do? God damn it. Now it's a Oh my god. <laughs> god damn it, my sim is too attractive. <laughs> no, this is serious. We need to change it. Ask about being dead. Oh no. Spoilers. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Uh, we need to ask just to be friends. God damn it. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> what, am I, what am I doing? We should we only be friends. There we go. God damn it. This is... Oh my god, why am I giving enchanting introductions to people? I do not know. I do not know. <laughs> I can check his eyes from here. Jesus Christ, this is on. Oh, the heck? oh look, it's Austin! <gasps> It's Austin as the, what do you call that? The assistant. Compelling diagnosis of maybe itchy plumbug. Better treat the patient. Surgical treatment. Jesus. I'm going to... Surgery. Oh my god, here's surgery. Why am I recommending surgery? This... Come on, do it right. Am I looking at the anus? <laughs> I just removed fish. Is Did I just remove that? Nope. <laughs> it's crazy. Ooh, surgery collaboration was a success. All right, that was crazy. Well, at least I already treat two people. I need to stop chatting with Kingston. You know the USB drives. <laughs> oh my God! Stop greeting. You are a bitch. You're a bitch, Kingston. No, I don't need to talk to you. Jesus. Hey, Austin, you doing okay? Or he's just chatting. I think he's just emailing people. Ooh, decent diagnosis chance. Hmm, a decent diagnosis chance. He's not showing symptoms, though. He also has... Sorry, eyes. Hmm. Compelling diagnosis of bloody head, triple set, or starry eyes. Since he has starry eyes, maybe starry eyes. I need to guess here, because sometimes 
I don't have time usually. Look at this. Let, let's see if we can treat the starry eyes. Let's see. There we go. Cured. Three out of five, finally. But it didn't work? Yeah. I shouldn't end work soon. Did you just fart again? I'm just waiting for this to be over. There we go. And I earned a vacation day. Nice. So, yeah, we're back home. So, I better end this episode now, dude. So, anyway, suits, I'm New Quitter. See you later.